Meant to be played in one sitting. Stay up to date on YouTube and Twitter. Ray Castley. Shall we begin? Is everybody ready? Does everybody have their drink? Their popcorn? <clears throat> their flashlights? <clears throat> the lotion? Their jork machine? Let's begin. Turn off the lights. My lights? You won't be able to see me at all. Do you guys prefer this or do you prefer the light in the background? October 8th, 1984. <gasps> the book? I saw an ad in the newspaper about a house sitting job. Freaking Celsius. Since I was short on cash, I decided to sign up. I can turn around, I'm almost finished. Are you working on like a school project? Find Maxime's house? Wait a second. First of all, the qual- I can't- The quality hurts my eyes. Jesus. Is that intentional? Guess so. You did this one? No, no, I never played this game. Is this game about Panda? Who are you? Excuse me, I'm trying to find a house on the street. Could you help me out? Yeah. Do I skip? Sure, which house are you looking for? I'm looking for Maxime's place. He hired me to look after it while he was away. Maxime? Yanovich? Hmm, that's interesting. He usually asks me to watch his place. Oh shit. They're they're in they have bad blood. I'm Marco Bot Botovsky, by the way. There's all Russians? Nice to meet you, Marco. Can you tell me where this house is? Is that Bear, bro? <laughs> it kind of does look like him. But no, it's Marco. Of course, it's two houses down. Mine's right here. Our neighbor Savo in the middle. And then Maxine's place. You can't miss it. <laughs> Thanks, Marco. I appreciate it. No problem. Now, if you'll excuse me, I just got my home automation system in the mail. I'm really excited. Oh, that sounds interesting. What does it do? Well, it's supposed to make life a whole lot easier. You know, controlling the lights, temperature, even the security system. Pretty cool stuff. Wow, that does sound convenient. Why did you decide to get it? Probably because of the recent disappearances happening around here. Oh, okay. But mainly because our neighbor Savo got one and won't stop raving about it. He left for vacation right after installing it. Said it has built-in surveillance systems and all. Guess he wanted to keep an eye on things while he was away. Well, I hope you enjoy setting it up. Thanks again for the directions, Marco. No problem. If you need anything, I'm I'm just a house away. I'm just a house away, but I'm... He's two houses away. Hmm. Guys, keep your, eye, keep your eyes on this Marco fella. Because he's two houses away. Because this is... This guy's apparently out of the... Out of town. He's got lights on and everything. That says clap clap up there. Which is the automation system, I'm pretty sure. Maybe he's... He got the thing so that he could, uh... Understand how it works, so that he could... Come terrorize me in this house. Hmm, I think the homeowner mentioned the keys would be in the backyard. Oh, I can sprint. I should go and check. I think they said they put it in the flower pots. I feel like I can't... I can't even see me. I'm gonna keep the lights on. Uh, flower pots? Oh, right here. Ah, oh, there they are. Let's see if these work. I suppose I could probably just go through the... No. Mark is gonna touch you, bro. Hey, yo. Hello? I can't see. Jesus. Well, that's uh, welcoming. They did say it was a smart house. Read note on fridge. 
Hey, thanks for house sitting. Please make sure to check the mailbox, water the plants, throw out the trash. Press Q to toggle the lights on and off in any room. PSSS. PSS. Once you're finished, help yourself to the food in the kitchen. A to-do list, just like home. All right, time to get acquainted with this place. It says, check the mailbox, water the plants, throw out the trash. I should take a quick tour, check out all the rooms. Okay. Oh, that's cool. I literally clap and the lights turn on. Whoa. Clap. I'm going to raid the fridge. Don't you worry. Toilet seat seems to be working. Oh, there's an echo in here. Speaking of chlamydia, guys. Explore the rooms three out of six. Throw that shit. <laughs> Must be a light show in the master bedroom. Who are these two? How to kill a house sitter? Um. If you were, if you were house sitting somewhere and you found a book that said how to kill a house sitter would you just continue yo buddha thanks for the tier one welcome to the fonzo family i appreciate that thank you thank you buddha welcome welcome horror 101 house seems pretty normal apart from the book that says how to kill a house sitter first i've got to grab the mail can't leave that lying around what does this say? I can't see what that says. Also, this room says caution, do not enter. Okay, I'm not allowed to enter there. Everyone has that book? No big deal? Oh, okay. That's my bad. I wasn't aware. What does this say? Clap, clap. Home automation systems. Turning your house into a smart house. Order 45,621. Clap, clap. Only 97 bucks? I wonder if I can scan that barcode and something will pop up. Turn on some news while we... Good evening and welcome to tonight's top stories. Oh, whoever made this recorded himself doing this. are actively searching for a missing house sitter in the Elm Street area. 25-year-old Chemical Zexon was last seen on June 23rd, 2023, while house sitting for a local family. Concerned neighbors reported him missing after noticing unusual activity and not seeing him for several days. It's actually a steal. As being six feet tall with black hair and brown eyes. He was last seen wearing a black sweater and a black hat. Police are Is that me? Anyone with information to come forward. Is there a mirror somewhere? Hello? Oh, I thought I just heard myself. Improve your memory. Researchers say that flavonoids found in chocolate can boost cognitive function. So, maybe that's... The hell is that? scary on movie on It's a lion ass TV. Missing, please help. Chem Cole Zexon. Last seen 23 September 1984 on Southford Park wearing a black sweater and black hat. He was doing house hitting services. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0. Missing house hitter, huh? Sounds like the beginning of a mystery novel. Wonder what happened. Alright, Bill's sorted. Now time to show these plants some love. <laughs> what do you mean by that?
So we got the watering. Oh, they're in the backyard. Water these plants, make sure we get all of them. Nice. Oh, I gotta do them all, my goodness. <laughs> this thing is hard to control. Make sure we get them all. I wonder if it can run out of water. I hope not. Or would we live in the desert or something? Why am I watering the plants? Surely they get rain. Somebody's walking back there. What's up, Dash? Scared part of the game is the chores? Yeah. Dude, there's somebody on the other side of that fence. Take out the trash from the kitchen. Somebody just go in that. Somebody just come in the house. Do you guys hear a door open? Wow, this bag's heavier than I expected. All right, what's with these bones sticking out? <laughs> what? Maybe I should lay off the detective novels for a while. Uh, I don't know about that. Are the bins outside or in the... Oh, that was definitely the front door that opened earlier. It's the same noise. You scared the shit out of me. Who are you? Stop! I'm Agent Ristolino, Federal Investigation Bureau. Jesus, the FBI is here. I need to ask you a few questions. Press one for scotch. Thanks for the 23 months, dude. Welcome back to the Ponzo family. I appreciate you, bro. Are you with the FBI as well? Are you hearing things? I'm most definitely not. Oh, wait, what do he say? There have been reports of disturbances in this area. Disappearances, strange phenomena. We're conducting an investigation. Yeah, I've heard. Everything's fine here. Just taking out the trash. Are you sure? We reasonably believe there's more to this neighborhood than meets the eye. Yeah, 100%. Just taking out the trash, you know? All right, but keep your eyes and ears open. We need to get to the bottom of this. Of course, we'll do. Thanks, Inspector. No problem. Stay safe out there. Jesus H. Christ, man. What the hell is wrong with his hands? That guy is definitely the monster. Might want to put that... Shove that shit in there, bro. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> it's fucking strange for all is that guy's hand. Um... Check upstairs rooms? Oh, goodness. Uh-oh. The caution sign is gone. Ghost is clapping cheeks. Oh goodness. That's not the door though, right? Yeah. I must be tired. I don't know if that's it, buddy. I should grab something you can go to sleep. These doors are closing on their own and they're making noises. It's scary.
Hello? The fridge is empty. This damn... Put cereal on bed upstairs? What is happening? The fridge is empty, but I have a bowl of cereal already made that's probably soggy as fuck if the guy left it for me. And now I'm about to be a psychopath and go eat it in my bed. Where even is this bed? Lay on bed. Okay. Why is the cereal, the bowl of cereal just sitting on the bed? What's up, Megs? What's up, Goose? How are you tonight, dude? Happy Scary Sunday, guys. No, no, grab it. This is a different, different, uh, developer. Hmm? This is what I'd be doing in the bed if it was realistic. Just EP. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why this, this, these, it looked like Fruit Loops. They look, they're probably fo soggy as hell. What's going on? Can I get up? What the hell was that? Genuinely. Figure out what is going on. <laughs> Great objective. Get this freaking bowl of cereal out of my bed. Oh, that's just big bro? Okay. Whoa, that door is knocked down. What the hell? Uh-oh. Clap, clap. Scissors. <laughs> He's cuddling the bowl of cereal. And at least seven feet tall. Whoa. Jesus Christ. What? What was that noise he just made? Rubber ducky. What's happening, man? <laughs> did he did he call me Steve? Oh my god! Oh, where am I supposed to run? I'm supposed to run downstairs. He's gonna kill me. No, he's not. He's slow as fuck. Gun. Where is he? What in the fuck? I need to get as far away from here as possible. I need to go talk to my neighbor who's just a house away. Jesus Christ, dude. Oh my god, guys. Marco's house. He's blood on his windows. I'm just house sitting. It's not even my house, Lauren. What? Can I go up there? Oh, I can't get close. The objective is just leave, but... 
<laughs> Wait, am I about to just end the game? Told you that man's tall as shit. True. I kept running until I reached the nearest police station. Is that the end of the game? While investigating, the authorities found Marco's lifeless body in his house. Meanwhile, Maxime's remains were found stuffed in the trash bag outside his house. Their neighbor, Sabo, has disappeared under similar circumstances. His remains have yet to be found. Despite the eerie scratches on the walls and my harrowing account, no trace of the creature is ever discovered. You are the slowest typer ever. The case remains unsolved, leaving an unsettling mystery behind. Okay, that game was a little bit too short. It could have been like 5 or 10 minutes longer and it would have been perfect. Thank you for playing my first ever indie horror game. Oh, my bad, bro. That was your first ever game? Okay, I take it back. You did a great job. I hope you enjoyed playing as much as I enjoyed making it. I will be releasing more. Okay. Nightmare File Series. Okay, sounds good. Good job. Oh, goodness, man. See up today on my YouTube channel, Ray Castley Games or Twitter. Ray. Thanks, Maxime. Oh, his name's Maxime. Dude, is this, is this Max? Did he quit Smite and start developing games? Honestly, that game was basically an 8 or a 9 out of 10 until it ended so abruptly. If it was 5 to 10 minutes longer, that would have been like a 9 out of 10 easily. But because it just felt a little too short, I'll give it a 6 out of 10. But it was pretty, I did like the, the vibes. The vibes and everything were good.